Well done, Gaffer, that's made it a really happy birthday. What a great finish to an afternoon and thoroughly deserved. Yeah, look, uh, it was a, a, a good afternoon. Uh, a, a funny afternoon in many ways because I thought our performance level was, was absolutely excellent. We, we had complete control first half, we, we dominated the game. Um, we had moments and, and good chances, especially at 0-0 early on, and we didn't take them. And then we can see the goal out the blue, which has kind of been our way so far. Um, I don't think we deserved that, but it was an excellent finish from a good player. Uh, and it would have been easy for our players to, to feel sorry for themselves. There's a huge crowd in here today, almost took over the stadium at times. And, you know, that can be challenging when things aren't going that your way. But when things are, they're absolutely unbelievable. And the atmosphere at the end was incredible. But the most pleasing thing for me was the way we performed. That's the best we've played for a long, long time. Certainly the best we've played away from home. Um, completely dominated the game second half. Um, created lots and lots of chances. Obviously, you know, the scoreline kind of flatters them a little bit I feel because of the dominance that we had and we need to improve more on our, on our last bit of detail the last finish the last pass the last cross um, but it would have been easy for the players to feel sorry for themselves and, and come away from the plan and, and not execute the way we did but they stuck together uh, they kept going and eventually we got exactly what we deserved obviously you totally dominated the second half it took such a long time for the goal yeah. to come but it was a case of just keep the faith keep believing keep getting into good areas and it will come exactly that and as I said the players have executed exactly what we spoke about exactly what the game plan was today um, obviously not ideal to go from behind but it's amazing that these players never give up and keep going right to the final whistle and I did feel that when it went to 1-1 I said to Dapo literally a minute before he scored that he'd get the winner there'd be a big chance coming his way and he, he did that uh, delighted for the players to come off the bench and impact it this is a very good squad of players it's, it's challenging to pick 11 it's even more challenging to pick 18 but they have to stay together stay positive and when it's not their turn to start they come on and affect the games the way they did and I thought the way Sads Josh Sheehan and Jan did that second half is really important. You said there's expectation at this club, but when things go well and the scenes at the end between the Amazing. players, the, the, the staff, the fans, it was a lovely feeling. And as, as I've said this many times, that like we are immensely proud to be part of Bolton Wanderers and me to be the manager, the staff to represent them, the players to play for this club. Um, it's incredible, and when we have days and moments like we have done this afternoon, it just makes me, you know, smile, makes my heart burst. Really. Um, yeah, great birthday present all around. Okay. And can't be a big moment. I know we've got to kick on and build on it. We don't play for a couple of weeks in the league, but it felt like a big moment. Turning a dominant performance into a win with two late goals. Exactly that, but as I said, the players have gone out there and executed exactly what we are trying to do. I thought we, we controlled the game from start to finish, really. Second half, lots of dominance and delighted that we got exactly what we deserve. Sometimes it's not that way. It's not that way was, in recent weeks, perhaps. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. I, you know, I said in the week that the data and the stats, the amount of chances we're creating, the way we're controlling games has, has been really good. Um, it just hasn't been going in the back of the net. Today we kept going, managed to find the goals that won us the game, but there's still lots of things to improve on, lots of work to be done. Um, but this this group's an exciting group to work with. Um, a really young team to start the game today as well, and I thought the way they handled the occasion was very good. Yeah, just keep improving, keep our heads down. We're not going to get too high after today, it's obviously nice, um, but we know we've still got lots of serious work to do. Yes, but you're past 30 points, you're in the top six, and you get a little bit of a breather from the league now. You know, it's a good position to build and, and have a push. Yeah, but nothing's given out in December. We've had um, ups and downs already this season, and it's a season of those. And for us, it's just about staying focused on what we need to do, keep working hard on the training pitch, stay humble, stay grounded, um, and keep our heads in the game, really. And I think we've done that and managed the difficult spells this last month or so. And today, as I said, that's the best we've played in a long, long time, and I'm really proud of the team.